I wasn't speaking to my parents. I hadn't seen my kids in over six months, not because they were taken from me, because I was a meth addict and I chose to leave the house one day. I didn't even say, Mommy, we'll be back. I just left. You don't understand. You, you, I need I you to be I am supporting you, but I need a break. I thought that people in my life with disposable relationships, girlfriends, mom, I just figured out I'll get new ones. Users isolate themselves from their families and friends as their lives start to revolve around meth. In the search to get and use more meth, addicts break promises again and again. They spend money on meth that the family needs to survive, sometimes even stealing from those they love to fuel their addiction. They become incapable of being good parents, partners, friends, and trust is gradually destroyed. I just separated myself and isolated myself from everybody I love, from my family members, from, from people that were really there to help me. I can remember a time when my dad had a quadruple bypass. I was high. I didn't find out till like a year later. I cried for a couple hours and then I went and got high. My meth use affected everyone in my family. It wasn't just a disease that I dealt with. What are you doing? I'm cleaning. Meth breaks up families and relationships as users behave in ways that are hard to forgive. Parents hurt their children by neglecting or abusing them and missing large periods of their lives. But most of these relationships can be restored in time. I was physically abusive to my daughter. She would look at me and I would just hit her. That's very hard for me to have. That's a very hard subject for me. One day, my, my little boy told me, you know what, Dad, I love you, but I feel embarrassed to see you in the streets. I don't want my friends to see me with you because they're going to make fun of me. When my daughter was very young, I, I'd take her with me. I would go to the dope man's house. I'd set her in front of a television, and I would go use. I feel that my meth use was very hard on my younger sister, she is a year younger than me. You know, she got somewhat trapped into the lifestyle. You know, not as much as I did, but I know that I definitely set the example for her and made her feel like it was okay. I can only imagine what families go through. The pain and the anguish that they go through in trying to save their family members, their sons, their daughters, their husbands, their wives. I mean, they... Because we, addicts who are in the thick of addiction, we're not seeing any of that. We don't see the wreckage that we cause. I wish I could take it all back, but you know, I can't. So, um, so all I can do is go forward and help heal my family and, and be grateful that I have them in my life. <laughs>